on uh, July the 31st, 1970, the New American Standard Version of the Bible was published by the Lockman Foundation. The Bible is regarded as the most literal 20th century version. The Revised Standard Version was also an update of the American Standard Version, but was less literal than the original, which was the main reason that people saw a need for a new version of the Bible. The New American Standard Version was designed to be true to the original languages, be grammatically correct, understandable, and give glory to Jesus. It has been revised now to a newer version by the Lockman Foundation, mostly because of the discovery of better manuscripts, especially the Dead Sea Scrolls, but also due to some readability issues. Where did the Lockman Foundation come from? It was during a tent meeting that Dewey Lockman was saved, and a few years later he underwent a realization based on Malachi 3.10 that giving to the Lord based on faith will bring blessings. He started with a 10% tithe, but the size of the tithe increased as the years went along. He eventually gave 40% of his income to God. When he had a few lean years as a farmer, he kept account of how much he owed and paid it back later. The foundation turned to Bible translation when it published the New Testament Amplified Bible in 1958. But it was obvious that a more general Bible was needed and this is where the New American Standard Version came from. After it was published, the Old Testament of the Amplified Bible was released. Besides working on English Bibles, the Foundation has published original translations of the Bible in many other languages. The Lockman Foundation continues today, although its founder has passed away. More studied Bibles are based on the NSAV than any other translation. Crosslink is publishing one of my books, Would You Do What They Did? Christian Leaders from Our Past should be coming out in October of this year. The book is going to have uh, biographies of Francis of Assisi, John Wesley, Martin Luther, and Thomas Beckett, written in creative nonfiction style, which is where you take uh, nonfiction events and write them as if they were fiction with the details as if they were fiction. So uh, I think you should enjoy that. I'm going to be coming out with a few videos uh, for some of my things that got cut and some samples from the book as well. I'm going to be coming out with Dawn on Lake Tiberius. should be coming out soon. And so please check that out. Uh, if you also want to get some more information about the book, uh, I should be updating that as it's coming along. It's williamdeanhamilton.net. Thank you very much.